Hey there, tennis fans. I'm Grace Carter, and this is Tennis Now, presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today, and it ships today. Well, well, making history at Indian Wells. Did you see it? Bianca Andrescu, boy, was that match something to watch. She became the first wild card to ever win the BNP Paribas Open. And that's not all the Canadian achieved. She also became the youngest player to win the title at Indian Wells since Serena Williams knocked off Steffi Graf on her debut in the California desert way back in 1999. And Andrescu is the first main draw debutante to win the title since, you guessed it, Serena in 1999. Now, we figured now would be a good time to look at the youngest women's singles winners in BNP Paribas history so that we can be ready with our stats in hand the next time some young gun shoots through the draw at Indian Wells. So here goes. Martina Hingis, 1998, 17 years, 166 days old. Ah, the Swiss Miss. Figures, doesn't it? It's Martina Hingis, who is the youngest player to ever win the title at Indian Wells, and she did it at the age of 17 years and 166 days old by beating Lindsay Davenport in straight sets. Serena Williams, 1999, 17 years, 169 days old. It was just one year later that Serena became the second youngest player to win that title when she knocked off Steffi Graf in her main draw debut. At the time, 29-year-old Graf had 106 titles to her name, and Serena, well, she just had one. But that didn't stop the young American from rising to the top in California. Several months later, Serena would capture her first major title at the U.S. Open. Monica Seles, 1992, 18 years, 90 days. Monica was the third youngest player to win the BNP Paribas title way back in 1992, and she defeated Conchita Martinez in that final. Celis capped a run that saw her drop just 12 games in the five matches at Indian Wells in one of the most dominant title runs the event has ever seen. Bianca Andrescu, 2019, 18 years, 275 days. Here's where Canada's Bianca Andrescu comes in. The Canadian is the fourth youngest to win the BNP Paribas Open, and she also became the first wild card to win the title on Sunday when she took out Angelique Kerber in three grueling sets. Making Andrescu's run all the more remarkable is the fact that she started this season outside of the top 150, and she had never played the main draw at a premier mandatory event before, ever. Next up, Daniela Hantakova, 2002, 18 years, 327 days. She's the fifth youngest to win Indian Wells, and she knocked off Martina Hingis for her first WTA title. It was the first of two titles at Indian Wells for the Slovakian, a former world number five. And finally, Maria Sharapova, 2006, 18 years, 333 days. The Russian claimed the title less than a month before her 19th birthday in 2006, defeating Martina Hingis in the semis and Elena Dementieva in the final. So there you have it, the six youngest women singles champions in Indian Wells history. Where does Bianca Andrescu's history-making run rank in terms of surprise factor? Have your say in the comment section below. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time.